Hello guys, I thought I would say hello and give you a little bit uh, of a context for this vlog because initially I had planned to actually just do a New York vlog but I realized that I filmed quite a lot of content between like Stockholm and New York and I still wanted to kind of like show you what I was up to and all of that and I think to like set the tone a little bit so um, those weeks were quite filled with like getting back home, getting back into our own routine, um, cooking better food for each other and just like you know having a good time but also kind of focusing on being at home and just yeah our own routine which is also largely surrounded by like what we cook and what we eat and um yeah so there's a couple of different like uh recipes that we did this week and uh, i thought that maybe that kind of content is still interesting for you guys if not i promise i'm gonna be back on like travel content soon and more like style um yeah style content but uh this is just all about like coming back home and cherishing like being home um and yeah i'm excited for you guys to see so let me know what you think hello everyone it's a very casual outfit for today but it's finally properly time for my tabby loafers and i am very excited to be wearing them again and this is the outfit just a lot of basics but i really 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 like the outfit and i think it might still be a little bit chilly outside and then i can just wear this closed and it still looks really cute and i don't know i'm really into blue denim at the moment and just i'm wearing good basics and yeah this is it have a good day i love cooking a good freestyle starter and i'm going to show you one that i did the other day and i thought it was super delicious and all you need is fresh tomatoes Fasales, some basil, feta or uh, mozzarella also works and either you have ultra bread that you can fry or you get like bread chips kind of like that and then some olive oil and some pomegranate um, balsamico and that's all you need. Step one, cut the tomatoes. Add the fasales and off to the next step. Of course, we have to add the cheese. So this is the finished salad. I can't wait to eat it now. I overslept so I'm late but I figured if I'm already late I can also film this so I am wearing a super casual outfit I need to add some jewelry in a second because I forgot I'm just seeing that now but I'm wearing my beloved um, Arcade blazer season after season it's my absolute favorite and also wearing just a white tank top then some jeans and I think these are monkey but i got them like altered um and these sneakers are a bit um shorter than the ones i wore when i got it altered but uh this jeans no uh, these jeans now fit so perfect i really really love them i'm obsessed with them they are perfection yes that's it bye bye
Hi guys, long time no speak. I don't think that I really talked to you guys since I have been back from Tokyo just because I went to Stockholm and then I've just been fairly busy with like getting back into my work routine and also I've started to go to my new office which I will show you all like at a different um, time maybe I'll add like a couple of glimpses here and there um, but for now I'm just getting used to the office myself and getting Finn used to the office as well and so um, there's not that much news in regards to that and yeah, I've just been super busy, but I wanted to sit down with you because I remember, um, I think it was the March vlog where I talked about like jewelry that I really enjoyed. Maybe it was February, but basically I was talking a lot about jewelry and what kind of jewelry I am um, looking into investing and what kind of jewelry that I really love. And I have recently added um, three jewelry pieces to my collection that have given me so so much joy and I really really want to show you and that's what we're going to do today. So the first piece that I really want to share with you I've just put on and it's this beautiful uh, Agmas New York ring and it's just super stunning. Let me see if I can put it on the other hand. I think I can show you nicer. Uh, it fits on my left hand on basically my ring finger. Uh, and I don't really know what I do if I ever get married, but it kind of fits on here as well. It's just a little bit looser. Um, and it's just, it's quite a bold design as you can see here. Uh, and I usually wear it on my ring finger on the left hand since I'm not engaged or married so it feels like I can just easily wear it on here and I just really 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 love the design it's just so cool and you can wear it either like this way or what I also sometimes do is like turn it around and wear it this way uh, and it doesn't really matter it's just a personal preference but basically I just play around with it what I feel like the day but yeah super nice design um, I'll definitely link it I don't really remember what it's called but yeah I wear this almost every day and I've gotten so many compliments for it as well because I think it's just such a like different looking ring that a lot of people will um, see it and they will have never seen something like it so I think that's why so many people like um, come up to me like I, I had this in Japan and a woman uh, came up to me and asked where I got the ring from it was like she, she thought it was so cool and so like unique um, and yeah I really love this one I feel like it's become <laughs> Not my whole personality, but honestly, I wear it almost every day. I love this ring so, so much. But let's move over to necklaces. Um, I got this. Sorry, I'm wearing like all like gold and pearls today. I'll take it off in a second. I didn't come prepared. Um, but yeah, so let's see. The necklace of all necklaces. It's the... Uh, listen dial um, or oh, how you pronounce this beautiful beautiful brand definitely not how I pronounced it but this is the packaging looking beautiful and the necklace is so so stunning um, let me see so it looks like this and it's quite um, a like heavy necklace and I really really just love the shell clasp and I will show it on in a second so it this is the necklace this is how it looks oh sorry this is how the necklace looks this is like the beautiful clasp and it's it's the detailing but you can also wear it like this i was wearing it in um in japan like sometimes just as the pearl necklace so i was putting this just in the back 
and the clasp i'm always worried i break it oh here we go so it's really nicely done so you just put this in here and then it closes so wait i'll show you so here we go and it's so beautiful like great fin so i have no idea where the video was cut off but all i wanted to say was if you don't want to wear the shell in the front it doesn't really matter you can just turn it around if you don't feel like it that day but then also you can uh, wear it in the front which I really like to do because I think that this little shell clasp is just perfection it's done so well and it looks so beautiful so I wear it a lot like this and let's go to the last uh, item that I bought the sun is coming around and the light is so beautiful in the bedroom right now but uh, let's focus on the last jewelry item which is um, from Louis Arbo and I think uh, maybe a lot of you know what's in here or can guess but it's a pair of stunning earrings that match um, basically my shell necklace really nicely so let me show you they come in this cute little pouch I love uh, the packaging of jewelry as well so this is the little pouch and um the it's a pair of earrings i think i've already mentioned that haven't i anyways uh it's these really really stunning earrings and they are just so beautiful and they're like the perfect statement but they are not too heavy like this is the back so they're actually quite like thin but they look so beautiful on. So let me quickly put them on for you. And here we go. This is how they look on. So imagine, I was like, having my hair kind of up like this, just like a messy kind of, um hairdo and imagine it's summer and yeah i think they just look stunning i've also worn them with my hair like quite um sleek uh to the back and then just a bun or yeah a ponytail but just with very sleek hair and that's absolutely stunning as well because it's just such a beautiful statement earring that isn't too heavy like i don't know why i'm stressing this fact so much but i think it's because i really hate um heavy jewelry so like i i hate heavy earrings i can't really wear them for a long time and so i'm so pleased with having these statement earrings which are a true statement but they are not not too heavy and yeah, I think they are so, so stunning. Just look at them. And that's it. Those are all the jewelry pieces that I really wanted to show you. And I hope you enjoyed it. And um, that maybe it helped you a little bit. I also uh, went to All Blues when I was in Stockholm, but that's a whole different story. I think maybe for a different day because now I am definitely saving up for one of their necklaces because uh, it's absolutely stunning. It's the perfect everyday necklace. I was way too excited in there um, to film anything, but uh, maybe I can um, insert some like photos, but I will film it another day because I feel like I've talked enough about jewelry now. Um, but yeah, these are my new pieces and I really, 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 really love them. Look at them. Look how pretty. <gasps>
it's a very chill Saturday and I've been out all day with Finn and we've just ordered some food and I'm taking him for his pre-dinner uh, round around the block and yeah, that's it. It's all of a sudden really warm in Berlin, like one day to the next, so I am going outside to walk the dog i think in this outfit and i think i'm not going to be cold so i'm starting to wear my birkenstocks again very happy about that so i still sound really uh, tired i'm just tired um and then i'm wearing my um gina trico x hannah uh, mw jeans which i always wear this is actually like a heavy cotton mango top, I think, from last year. This is a vintage uh, Ralph Lauren um, shirt, which I really love. And then I'm wearing my Majuri pearl necklace and my, uh, I think, Vela, that's the sunglasses brand's name. And yeah, that's it. I really did crop the egg, but this is going to come together to a beautiful lunch. Give me a second. So first of all, I am adding some of the cucumbers and apparently dropping it all. I can't do that while filming. So I have added avocado and um, the pickled cucumber and now, of course, the egg. And here we go. That's a super easy lunch. <laughs> <laughs> 